Hey, this is Jay. Happy Zer Day. Happy Friday. How in the world are you guys doing? Zer is actually at the reef over here on this right hand side. And it looks like I am the first to get to him. Sometimes he shows up on time, sometimes he's a little bit late. It's a little bit weird. But all right, okay, not too bad. Oh, two really good things that I think you're going to be excited for if you don't have them already. So. Um, let's get into these and go over them though. Helm of Saint 14. This is all intellect at 125, which isn't a bad stat roll. Pretty darn close to the max at 136. You get increased melee attack speed, more super energy from non guarding kills, and then Ward of Dawn blinds enemies who enter it. You definitely want to pick this up for that last perk alone. It is great in PvE and comes in handy. I tell you what, this is the exotic that I run probably most often on my Titan, so definitely pick this up. Now we've got the Kepri Sting. This is, of course, for a hunter. It's all strength, which isn't the best stat roll. I think max is 120. But gain invisible at invisibility after crouching in place for a short time. Melee attacking an enemy from behind while invisible delivers four times the damage. You get increased reload speed with primary weapons and reduces melee cooldown each time you pick up an orb of light. So this piece of exotic is a newer one. It is kind of quirky. It's one of those exotics that comes in handy very rarely, so it's kind of different. So I'd hold off on this both in PvE or PvP um, and get something else if you're short on coins. But if you're not, go ahead and pick this up. But the Obsidian Mine, this is for Warlock class, is all. It, this is half intellect and half strength. Not the best stat roll, for instance. Mine is a 74 intellect and 59 strength so not the greatest but increased grenade throw distance increased super energy gain from killing minions of darkness yes that is awesome nova bomb kills reduce the cooldown of your next nova bomb so that is really cool and that is what makes this one really good you can actually chain nova bombs if you get a ton of kills you can actually get your next nova bomb so definitely pick that up and then we've got the patience and time sniper rifle did I say sniper? Sniper rifle. You've got third eye radar stays active, which is really good. You've got um, custom optics, fitted stock, and field scout. And I think I usually usually run field scout. But uh, then you have you gain active camouflage while this uh, while you're aiming down sights. So that is why you would actually buy this one. It's kind of fun to play around with that. It kind of works, kind of doesn't work, but I'd definitely go ahead and pick this up if you don't have it already. But that is what Zer has to offer. Of course, he's got exotic shards and helmet engrams, and you can read the rest as I go over them. But hey, just wanted to remind you that if you're new to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. And if you haven't connected with me on Twitter and Facebook, you can find me at Judgment Awaits. Just search for those or you can look in the description of this video. And I've got links to both of those in there. And I'm really good at responding to people if you contact me with those ways and if you contact me here on YouTube. But that's where I'm going to end this video. Let me know what you're picking up. Let me know what you guys still need. As you guys know, TTK is about to drop. So I'm trying to get uh, my son to get all the exotics. You can check out my exotic hunt video. That's where he actually runs the Nightfall. And I actually taped his gameplay this week and a video camera of him. So check out that video. Also, Solo Valis, if you want to check out that. But I think that's where I'm going to end it. Actually, I'm going to tell you a story. I uh, actually had a dream last night that I actually bit my nails and it kind of freaked me out. Not really freaked me out, but I actually quit biting my nails after, you know, almost 40 years. I've been biting my nails for a ton of time and uh, I actually quit and I've been quit for about a month. I think it was harder to stop biting my nails than it was to stop smoking, but uh, I actually had a dream that I bit my nails and I was so mad at myself and so disappointed. And then I woke up and realized it was just a dream. Oh, and I was so relieved, but thought I'd share with that with you because it's just kind of funny how lame I am. But uh, let me know what you guys got going on this weekend. I've got a three day weekend and I'm really looking forward to it. But that's where I'm gonna end this one, guys. As always, take care and God bless.